Hello here, so welcome back to just another dang how to channel. So in this video, we're going to learn how to install the Unreal Engine 5.1 preview. So it's officially out. Uh, if you open up Epic Game Launcher and go under uh, Library, under Engine Versions here, click on this plus arrow. And under the drop down arrow here, you would see you now have option for 5.1.0 preview. So click on that and then click on install. You'll get this warning message that this is for testing only and it's not fully tested yet and may be unstable. But this is a better way of getting the Unreal Engine 5.1 instead of building it from the source. So go ahead, click on install. It would prompt you on which folder you want to install it. Go ahead, change that to suit your needs. But for me, I'm just going to keep it on the default. It would take some time to initialize and I'll get back to you once the installation is done. So the installation is done. Uh, I went back to the Unreal Engine product roadmap under Unreal Editor native support for Apple Silicon. Uh, this is still experimental. And if you read the fine print, it would say that the Epic Games launcher would to continue to provide only the x86-64 binaries for Unreal Engine. Uh, users who want to try the ARM64 version will still need to build from the source. So I have a tutorial on how to build from the source. So this one that got installed is still running on Intel. So if I launch this and it's still buggy, I tested it out. Uh, still, some shaders are not working properly on an Apple Silicon machine. So I have this open. Uh, if I open up the activity monitor and look up Unreal Engine Editor, you would see the kind is still uh, Intel. So if this was the Apple Silicon native, you would see the kind here showing as Apple. Anyway, so I have a existing project here. If you open that up, you will be prompted that you want to make a copy of that version. So go ahead and click on open a copy. And this is how that looks like. Uh, let's open up the content drawer. I think I have the ramen shop in here. Uh, I noticed that I started getting this one, no regions loaded. So one way to fix this is go under the world partition highlight that section and right click and say load selection and that should open that up so you can see it's still flickering uh, so it's still buggy on my end still not usable uh, so i'll probably wait a few more until they iron out um, all the issues with uh, uh, 5.1 but uh, yeah i'm gonna try out some of the product roadmap here and see uh, what uh, particularly uh, is working out of the bat and what's not working uh, stay tuned for that okay that's it just a quick video and how to install and get started on it uh, hope you like this video thumbs up thumbs down uh, cheers bye for now